Let's go ahead and check these chickens. Marjorie reckons there's some missing. So I'm guessing the fox has been at them. She should have put them away. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Definitely some missing. Uh, let's feed Frank. Frank needs feeding. Here we go. Here we go, buddy. Get your gnashes round that. He's got it easy, any. Right. Off to see David, see what he wants to do. We've got pretty much all the bales in. We've got a lorry coming to pick a load up this morning. Oh, I need to do those stumps. Oh, well. Yeah, so he's got a lorry coming to pick a load up this morning. And uh, we've still got some in a field. But uh, I don't know what his plans are, so... We'll head down there and find out what he wants to do. Here we go. Into the yard. Hmm. Where should we park? Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'll park by the Bowser. Yeah, that'll do it. We're out the way then. Lovely jubbly. Let's see. See where he is. There's the bales. They're going in a couple of days, I think. Morning mate. What's the plan then? Can you go up to Patrick's field and plant the corn for me? Yep, do you want me to take the JD? Aye, I suppose you have to. Once you've done that, can you go into the field opposite the farm here and get those bales in on the trailer for me? Yep, I can definitely do that, mate. So what are those bales for? Oh, they're going to Pierre, but they haven't got to go straight up there yet. Okay, well I'll crack on with it all then. I'll see you later. Ta-ta, John. Right. John Deere. We are privileged to be using the John Deere. I don't know if you remember back to a while ago, but um, he doesn't like people using his, tra his tractor. And he only let me use his old John Deere because he got this new one. So, yes, very privileged today. Better not bash it up already. There we go. Right. So we need to get it filled up. So the seed's over there. So we'll back up to it. And then we'll give her a check over. Just to make sure everything's okay. Lovely. Right. Let's have a look then. That's all okay. They're all good. Yep. All in order. We all coupled up properly. Yep, that's good. Excellent. Right. Well, let's head up to Patrick's field then. Plant some corn. I was just having a thought whilst I was driving up here. I'm going to pull in here and I'll show you the big stack of bales that we've got here that are going this morning. There we go. 
nice stack there I think there's 24 there or there or thereabouts so they're off and if we have a little snoop over the hedge here you can see Patrick's cows I don't expect they're producing much milk at the moment anyway we turn right here I'm going to do his little field first I guess we'll be doing the other one a bit later on. But we'll get this one done. So, I've been thinking about what I'm going to be doing over the winter. And I've got a few projects that need to be done. First one that we need to do is the Little International. She needs restoring and sorting out. I think my plan for that is to either sell it or try and trade it in once it's done up against the slightly bigger tractor because we're going to need uh, some more some more horses I think my one with the loader on she she's a good tractor but she's she's not particularly powerful so I think we need to upgrade tractors at some point So I'll just, just drop this down. There we go. And then obviously my other my other little projects that we've got. So we've got the sprayer that needs a, a good service and we need to make sure that all works and everything. And of course we need to make a plan for the shed. We need to get the stumps out of the ground and get the get the footings down at least maybe even get the shed up over winter that would be nice and then we can start putting the equipment in there and stop being a little bit cluttered I think we're getting a little bit cluttered and I've got some other machinery and things that I want to get so we've got to get ourselves sorted Yeah, that, that's that's the plan really for the winter is to try and get a load of that done, and then we can see where we come out at the other end of it. See what work we can get. But I think we'll crack on with this at a nice and steady pace.
And that's us finished in here. Whilst I, was, whilst I was doing that, I was having a, a little think to myself and there was, there was quite a few things that I need to get done actually up at the yard because Marjorie wants to uh, get her greenhouses put up too so we've, we've got that to do and then I'm going to have to probably build some kind of fortress around the chickens to stop them from going missing or else I'm going to get moaned at and nobody wants to be moaned at do they life's hard enough as it is without being moaned at uh, I don't know get up and get this top top bit done and we will be done in the field I'm quite impressed with this tractor. It's very comfortable. It's very powerful. It's been doing the job quite nicely. But it is filthy. It needs clean. Oh, a little bit there. Missed that bit. There we go. Lovely jubbly. So that's that one done. So we've got bales to sort out for Pierre now. Not heard much from him actually in the past, past couple of days. Usually you hear some it, either from Doyle or hear from him himself, but no, not heard anything. So I don't know whether he's disappeared again. I'd love to get. I'd love to know what he gets up to. He's a very strange bloke. Anyway, that'll be for another day. So, negotiate. Yeah, we're all good. We'll jump out and close the gate. No doubt we'll be back here putting some fertilizer on it at some point. There's where that car went and hit that tree. Oh, and the horses. That's this is where the horses are. There they are, look. Two of them. So I still don't know who these people are, but they've bought that yard. And they've bought the house that goes straight up backs onto that yard and the field and I've got two horses in there and obviously we have one out in the field with us who David thought was a camel right so we'll pull up in here oh he's still here he must be having his lunch then Let's get, let's get this done. He must have got rid of them bales. The JCB's moved, so he must have done that. Lovely. We'll leave that for another day. Okay. So we'll get New Holland into the field. Oh, no. It's the wrong side, isn't it? I'm thinking. So we'll get into the field with this. All good. There is one thing about this this front axle, this turning axle. It does get you out of some sticky situations, some tight areas. It's very good with that. 
But it, does, it is really weird when you're driving along and you're turning and the axle turns and it's like, whoa. Very clever idea. A lot of thought went into it. Yeah, that, that should do it. So we've just got those eight there. And we've already stacked. I'll run and get the JCB. And uh, we'll think about some more things that we need to get on with, I guess. All good? Lovely jubbly. I do prefer this grab the spikes, it's much, uh, much better. Much better for picking bales up. Big old grab, look at that. Get it out of the way, really. Let's get it out. See what's going on. So what we got? All clear. Splendid job. We're just manoeuvring. painless wasn't it? I strap these on. One, two, oh, I suppose I better put four on. That one and that one. Yeah, lovely job. Nice. So we'll run the JCB back. And then we'll run back for the New Holland. And I think we'll call it a day after that. Yeah. Well, yeah, we're yeah, we'll good. So yeah, going back to Marjorie's uh, greenhouses. So she wants to, she wants to grow vegetables. And then she wants to try and sell them at the market. So that'll be interesting. But um, who am I to put a dampener on her her dreams? I've got my dreams. And she's fully supportive of me, so I shall support her. And we'll see what we can do with the market store, I guess. But yeah, we really need to try and. 
get as many contracts as we can for some for some work because obviously you know when when Daniel comes back after all his broken bits and pieces have healed he is going to be wanting his new Holland back I guess which is fine by me because it's not red Let's go. Where should we put this lot? I think. We're gonna get in. Yeah. I think. Well, we just pull it up here. I think actually, it's probably the best place. And we'll leave the trailer on because if it's got to go down to Pierre, it's uh, just as well stay loaded. Oh, he's gone. He's gone now. There we go. Right. That's us for today. I better close this all up. I don't know what time he's coming back, so we'll get it all closed. We'll do this one as well. Good old trailer that. And that one. Lovely. Right. Well. That's today done with. We shall head off home. see what's waiting for us.